A, a neat way to demonstrate Newton's third law of motion for every action there's an equal and opposite reaction is to use a balloon and uh, let it go along a string. I have here a nylon fishing line strung up between two points and threaded that through half a straw. Then I'll take a balloon to blow it up and attach the balloon to the straw so that it hangs on here with the open end of the balloon pointing uh, back. And then we'll start at one end, release the air, and you can then see the balloon fly along the string. You can use this uh, as a classroom activity by having students uh, make their balloon rockets and see how far they can actually go by, by stringing lines from one end of the room to the other and then releasing their balloon rockets. So as the air escapes from the open end of the balloon, it exerts a force in one direction and the reaction then is the balloon going in the opposite direction. This is the principle of a rocket. With a rocket in space, for example, you have the hot gas is going out in one direction, that's the action, and that propels a rocket in the other direction, which is the reaction. The rocket does not need to blast against another object in order to work.